that have to do with the future of finance, the future of commerce, the future of retail. Tech Fair will be holding fully on the 27th of November 2019, holding at Ladmark Center in VI. I will be there. If you're a startup person, whether you're in tech and e-commerce or retail, you should absolutely be at this event to see exactly where the future is headed and to stay, you know, one foot in the future and one foot of course in the present. I think it's such a powerful event and if you if you don't know about it, now you do. And I hope to see you guys on the 27th in real life. If you see me, call me. Let's take a selfie. So if you go to my website, to the website hellofounder.co, once you log onto the website, the homepage is a homepage for a specific reason, right? So the homepage is just like a quick, it tells you everything about the site. The homepage is like you're going to the market and you're just showing you everything. If you're wondering, yes, honey, I built this entire website by myself. So it's telling you different things, right? But when you move on to a landing page, a landing page is where you say, I want to buy Gary, for example, and then they will tell you, oh, this is the part of the market where you're going to buy Gary from. So when you click on the book club, for example, this is what you see. Now, this is a landing page. On the landing page, I'm not selling everything. So I'm not selling everything that's available in my company. I'm only just selling the idea of the book club to people um just if you guys don't know yet there's an article um inside the hello founder community where i share 10 different tools that you can use to build a, land, a landing page this particular landing page for example i created using mailchimp this particular one so there are other tools that you can use to build up quick landing pages for different purposes now to get in the tool we're going to be using today to build a landing page is called card.co now the reason why i'm mentioning card is because this particular product is so good on mobile and it has a lot more features than a lot of the other products that are really good on mobile so card.co is c-a-r-r-d dot co that's card.co right so once you open it this is what it looks and it simply tells you build one page size for pretty much anything so what you what you simply want to do is you, you log on here this is what you're going to get. This is what the platform looks like, right? So the first thing you want to do, if you've not confirmed yet, just go ahead and start the process of doing other things. So tap on that and it will tell you to choose a starting point. Now what you're seeing here, these are all like different um, templates that you could use for your website. If you want to preview templates real quickly before you decide on which one to use, just come to where you have demo, just for you to open demo, just hold it down like this, like tap on it and hold it down, open a new tab and you can open as many as you like. So the demo will show you what the websites look like so that you can choose to work with them. So after that, open the tab and start to look at the different ones. Oh, I think this one is so beautiful. I already love it so much. Yeah, I really like this one. So this is the one we're going to use. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to head back in here and I'm just going to come here and I'm going to click on select. Awesome, so I clicked on it, it's open now. And it's opened up, great. So now that it's opened up like this, the next thing we want to do is to start to put things inside. So the first thing you have is this area and we want to edit it. So we're just going to click on this and I want to um, open here and I would say, want to launch a business, but don't know how. So this is how I started out. Want to launch a business, but don't know how. That's the first thing that you're going to see. The next thing is I'm even going to go ahead and highlight right here and I'm going to add more, which is your dream business is a few steps or instead of that, a few hidden steps away from here, right? So that's the first thing that you have. Now you would notice the arrangement of the text. I don't like it. So I'll tap on that area again. 
and I would like rearrange by tapping in here and moving some things to enter so let's see what it looks like now exactly and then here I would just simply say for the button I will use book a 30 minutes consultation and this is what it looks like so it says book a 30 minutes consultation right there now usually what happens is if you're going to use um, tools like Calendly to ask people to book a consultation Calendly is the tool that I mentioned in this video it's one of the many tools I mentioned in this video where I talk about um, different tools that will help you with productivity as a solopreneur in your business if you have not seen the video yet go see it linked in the description awesome so now that we have this the next thing you want to have you want to do is click on this and we're going to click on upload um i don't have pictures already saved to my phone so usually you're supposed to have gotten stock photos that you're going to use let me just grab this picture of my folio that i love so much because she is awesome so let's say we're going to put you know this picture of marie on here and automatically this is what it looks like so this picture now could be um we'll just say something for example like want to build i wouldn't i wouldn't use this line in my business i want to build a business like marie folio okay i think that's too much um this is what it looks like so i want to build um an intro an info business like marie folio um and i will go on to continue to edit all the different elements in here so i could come in here and i would say marie is one of the most successful people in the information business right and then but she had to start somewhere and she got all the help she could so now i've done this look at what it looks like the next one you come here again to where you have this box in here tap on it upload so i'm going to grab another person okay yeah so this is morgan deborn i love her so much she is the founder of Blivity. great so um next thing you've got this one so i hope you guys are seeing how this is is is, is building into something and then here we're going to say morgan the born if exactly so now you have morgan the born and i'm going to also come in here again and i'm going to write something really really cool okay so you say Morgan is the co-founder of Blavity a very successful website great now I'm done with that now we've got two and then you have the last one which is here actually so I'll throw in the picture of Nat Natalie great and there and then the last person is natalie ellis done and then we're going to come here real quick and we're going to point out and write okay This is such a cool landing page <laughs> great so now i have this landing page right and i have this now this is supposed to be the last part where you tell people to sign on and all of that but i want to add more so before i edit this button right here i'm going to come up right here to the plus sign above and i'm going to tap on plus now what this gives you is a bunch of things that you can add to this theme that you already have so you could add um, text image video list all of those things depending on what you want to add in here and make it out to be your landing page right for me personally i want to add um something that says let's help you get started right or something like that 
So to do that, I'm going to come into where I have text and that's exactly what I'm going to add. And then I'm going to say, even the best entrepreneurs today had help when they started, right? And I would say, and done. So this is what you're going to find it's right there so it's at the bottom when you're done you're going to find that what you just created is at the bottom so what you want to do with the plus is tap and hold tap on it hold it and then just move it up notice that my how my hand is moving this up so you want to move it up to where you want it to be and for me i want it to be before you have the ceo you smudge or whatever then you tap on it again and this time you want to increase it you want to make it really really big so you come and tap on this second like the box like thing that you have inside here and then what you want to do is you start maybe like moving the height of the text increasing it and then once you're done with that you you move this until you find where it has size come to where you have size you really just want to drag it and increase it right so once you've done that you then want to go into where you have done and notice how the text is now big so it's even the best entrepreneurs today had help when they started let's help you get started right okay now that said i could choose again to add another thing so i want to add like um an icon a link or a timer or something or a button so let's say i want to add a button right there so i'll just tap on button add button come to where i have label and i'm just going to say right here again i'm trying to prompt people to book a 30 minutes right so book a 30 minutes free consultation done now, assuming you have the Calendly link and all of that, you want to come into this place where you have URL and place in any of the links. So if you're linking to your WhatsApp or you're linking to your Calendly or you're linking to wherever, that's where you go and you place in the links. And when you're done, you just tap on done. And that's it. So the next thing I want you to notice is if you look at the button, you will see that the text you have with book a 30 minutes free consultation might be really way much, way bigger than the, um, than the button so what you can do is quickly just tap on on here and what you want to do is to look for size so you scroll down to where you have size and you want to reduce it a little bit you're, you're reducing the size of the button let's see and all of a sudden you will notice that this is no longer out like it was before it has fit in and again tap on it hold it and move it to where you want it to be so you've seen that this is now what this area looks like awesome and then the next thing i want to do is to add like things like you know the features of what i'm offering so i'll go to plus and i'll go to where i have you know text again and in text if it opens up this we just come and click on the a i'm going to quickly write uh, we'll say so notice that the text would, might look different don't freak out it's just the way this new theme works so you will have weekly live videos tap plus again and i want you to head to where you have icons so when you open icons just click on email and they will say type email or whatever click on type and what we're looking for is something with video because what i said was live videos L let me say i end up using down arrow right so once that's done just tap on done and you want to drag the new icon that you just created so if you've done it you're going to see this is going to pop up immediately so that will pop up immediately so boom right this landing page is set already now when you're done with this you don't want to share and publish your site so what do you do you come up here you tap on that and you go to where you have published and you tap on publish and you give your site a title so for me i'm just going to to type to type starter badass right i don't even know what that means whatever this is just how you people can map stuff so i'll tap on starter badass and here i will type on 
starter badass and if this url is available you will see it right here come up as available